what is the smallest solution to the given equation? So we have this equation here, and the first step we can do is to get rid of the square roots. And we can do that by squaring both sides. So when we square both sides, like this, it'll get rid of the square roots. So we'll just be left with what's inside. So we'll have x minus 2 squared on the left, and 3x plus 34 on the right. Okay, so now let's expand out this uh, squared term. So we'll be left with x squared minus 4x plus 4, and then we'll have 3x plus 34 on the right. So let's move this 3x to the other side. So we'll keep the x squared, we'll have negative 7x, and then let's move this 34 to the other side. We'll subtract 34 from both sides, so we'll be left with negative 30 equals 0. Okay, now let's factor this out, and if you factor this, you'll get x minus, uh, x minus 10 and x plus 3, because negative 10 times 3 is negative 30, and then negative 10 times x plus 3x is just negative 7x, and then x squared x times x. So this will just equal 0. Okay, so now we have this expression, that uh, equation that's factored out. So we can use the zero pr product property to see what the values of x are. So in this first parentheses right here, if we plug in a value of 10 for x, it'll equal 0, and when we multiply that with uh, any other term, it'll just be 0. So that satisfies the equation. So one of our solutions is that x equals 10. And then in the second parentheses here, if x equals negative 3, then negative 3 plus 3 equals 0. So then anything times 0 is just 0. So that satisfies the equation as well. So x just equals negative 3 as well. But then the question asks us for the smallest solution give to the given equation. And negative 3 is smaller than 10, so we'll use negative 3 as our solution. So negative 3 is the answer.